Hello, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Kieran Joseph, I'm your boxing coach today. And today we'll be doing the right hand cross, or if you're a southpaw, it will be your left hand cross and the different types of variations. Okay? The right hand cross, usually we use the jab to set up this punch, all right? This is usually they call a knockout punch, all right? But if you can't hit someone with your lead hand, very unlikely you're gonna hit them with that hand. So you always need to make sure you're in range. So let's just run through the mechanics of that punch anyway, all right? So elbows in. And you're going to rotate the back foot, it all starts from the trunk, turn your knees, turn your hips, finish your punch out long, okay? So I'll show you in one motion, and it comes back, all right? And then comes back. So Andrew, if you take your stance from me, so you're going to work on that back foot. First, we're just going to go through the basic cross, all right? The straight cross, okay? You ready? Make sure it's coming from the chin, keep your elbows in. Always start from the back foot, and... That's it, it's good. Rotate through the hip, ankles, knees, hip, and then finish with that punch, all right? Let's go, make sure that elbow comes straight out. Straight, there we go, it's good. And then one more, it's good, it's perfect. All right, how are we gonna make that punch better, all right? I like to imagine that the, your, punch, your hands are on a pulley line, okay? So if your hands are on a pulley line, if my left hand goes out, if I'm throwing my right hand, I need to pull that one back, okay? So if I'm just throwing a straight right hand, that means my left hand's already at my face, so there's nothing to pull back. So if I'm there, I've got to use my hips. So if it's a pulley, as I throw the right hand, I'm really going to pull this arm back, all right? You're going to try that for me five times. Ready? Go. There we go. A little bit more speed on there. Hey, there we go. Two. Woo! Three. Four. Five. One more. Wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Lovely, it's good. Now that's how you throw a right hand cross, right? Now if I was you, if you see this woman out here, be mindful, learn some defense before you cross this lady here, all right? So you're always trying to make that sharp, fast punch, all right? Your jabs don't need to be, they don't need to be seen, okay? If they can see your jab or your straight punches, it means you're throwing it wrong or you're too obvious with it, all right? It needs to be sharp. When you go to the body, all you gotta do is change your height. Okay, so you're gonna bend your knees, sink down, as my right hand comes there, take your head off the middle line, that's it, it's good, and then bring it back. Make sure you rotate a bit more, you can put a little bit more weight on that front foot, all right, you ready? Go, one, that's it, don't turn too much. Two, perfect, good. Three, four, five, that's good, all right. Now we're gonna mix the two together, and then I've got one more variation. So we're gonna go head, the right hand, and then I'm gonna come to you, and then body, all right? All right, that's all right, it's all right. You ready? Go. One, two. There we go again. One, two. One, two. There we go. Let's get it. Keep going. Good. Two more, two more. One more. Lovely. It's good. All right. So that's how you can change your target with the same punch. Cross to the head, dip down with your legs, cross to the body. Okay. All right. So that's the body shot. And the last variation is the overhand right, which is usually to evade another punch coming back at you, all right? So if you're th throwing at the same time, you're trying to just beat your opponent by getting over their punch and reaching them before that punch gets to you, okay? So it's all a timing thing. It works better with a partner, but if you're imagining punch is coming straight at you and you arc it over the top, boom. And it's still a straight line, boom. One more, boom, okay? Some people mistake this shot for a hook, all right? It's still a straight punch. It's just traveling a different route, all right? So it's not going straight down the middle, all right? That one there. It's going arcing over the top to still get to the same destination, all right? So I'm gonna show you what that looks like, okay? So if you get your stance from me, it's good. So you remember what I was telling you before? So if I throw this hand at you, you're gonna come over that hand and you're gonna hit this target here. There you go, that's it. But you see what you got to do with the back foot? Put the cigarette out. Ah, oh, there we go. So you see you can reach it, all right? So you come back there. So as I come to you there, that's it. It's good, all right? Do it nice and slow. Boom, that's it. It's all about timing. Boom, that's good. Boom, ah, oh, good shot. Boom. Good. That's it, don't turn too much. It's good, all right? Now let's get some speed on it, all right? You ready? You ready, go. Oof. There we go, that's nice. Turn your hips with it, turn your foot. That's the best one, there we go. Good, give me two more. Boom, good. One more, 
Bam, it's good. And that's the variation. So, right, so now we're going to have some fun and we're going to mix all three of them up. All right, you ready? Oops. It's only right hands, it can't be that hard. Oops. All right, straight, straight, body, uh, straight, body, overhand, hey, straight, overhand. Yeah. <laughs> this I was waiting to do, I was waiting to do. Sorry. All right, you ready? Yeah. Overhand, uh, straight, body, straight, overhand, straight, body, straight, Overhand, ah, uh, straight, body, straight, overhand, ah, uh, straight, body, hey, straight, overhand, ah, uh, damn, I, I could do that all day, all right, could do that all day, but that is it for today, so go and practice those three variations, and then look out for the next video, thank you very much, take a bow, lovely. <laughs>